Yo, what's up? This is a Waka Flaga quick tip, and uh, I would say this is one of the most important things to know because this right here can make you or help you take over the game completely within just three or four minutes of the game, okay? However, with this, there's two conditions that is required for it to work most optimally, and you'll understand why as we play through this here. One, you have to be red side because it won't work as well on blue side. And I would not even try doing this on blue side at all. So most likely you have to be red side and also the jungler should start red buff. So in most cases you'll know that the jungler is starting red. So then you can go on to try in this here. Okay, but before anything else more here, I hope you guys are having a good morning, evening, night, whichever one fits. Shit like that, you know the drill. Okay, so... To start this off here, you cover red, standard thing here, and then it, it starts off with the thing that I mentioned, where you take red buff and then you go to the opposite side of the map, right? Which is bot lane on red side, okay? And also, you can't do this on opposite side too, however, it's not going to be as easy to pull off and more risky at times too. And uh, that's mostly because the top laner is going to be tankier, they're going to get XP faster, um, it's harder to pull off with just the top laner because he has to get waves or whatever, right? And how this starts off is a standard one. This is D2-D1 by the way, so it's not like it's against bad players. So you start off doing the bottling gank, if successful, you can proceed to the next step, okay? And the next step here is what's going to help you take over the game completely and just tilt the enemy beyond anything, okay? You're going to go into this push here. You also want to have a ward, so you can do this here, okay? And you should ask your support to come. I asked Anna, she didn't really listen, which ended up being a bit unfortunate here because it would have gone way better. However, it still works, right? Just very unfortunate because it gone it could have gone a lot better, but it just goes to show that even in cases like this where you don't even get the help of your support, you're still able to do this. And they had a misfortune and Yumi here. Right? And as I said, this is a D2 D1 game. I'm not sure what this Yumi is doing. So uh that's that, right? And then at this point here, the enemy is just completely fucked in the head. They're just tilted beyond anything. There's not really much they can do anymore. The bot lane has got one kill, two kills, assist, etc. in this situation here. So like, the head start that you just give towards your entire team and everyone is just so huge. Right? And then you can do even more if you want. Like you can see we're doing it to the Misfortune now. Because they are both level 3. Misfortune's level 1. So yeah, I mean, it's not really hard to kill her or dive her at this point. Because of the level of which our lane is, as opposed to theirs, right? Level 3 versus level 1, them being two people versus one person that's level 1, it's easy to dive. And here's with Senna and Sire, which are champions that are not even really that tanky. And then at that point, the jungler, someone has to do something. It's important to pay attention to the map, see if anyone's rotating or coming to help, because, I mean, it's, it's very likely that the bot lane is going to beg for help at this point. So yeah, that's what you should do, try to do, pull it off, if it doesn't work, whatever, try it again. You know, just learn to like know when you can try it and when you can do it. Because when you do get these kind of things off here, as I did here, the game is basically just over as I've said, and I think most people can agree to that. I mean, I've got three kills and two assists within no time here. So yeah, that's basically it. As I said, only really works on red side because of red to bot lane and you also do need the jungler to start red side in most cases because if he starts blue then he's maybe going to be near or close to bot lane when this happens so then he can come and counter and at that point we are most likely not going to win okay but if you do then even more kills even better however it's not worth the risk i would say because you lose a lot of tempo if you do die. However, in most cases, it will be safe and it will be okay to do. 
And yeah, as I said, and most people can agree with, most likely, I would like to believe is that the game is just over at this point. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. This has been a quick flick, quick flick, waka flaka video. Uh, quick tip. So yeah, have a good one. Peace. Thank you for watching. Have a good one. Bye. Peace, etc.